From an early age, I've always liked bouncing on the trampoline. To me, it's fun. I just love it. I like the feeling of flying high in the air like a bird. Her name is Lily, a beautiful, shy, easygoing 10-year-old that likes nothing more than to train, hang out with friends and family, and her two favourite dogs, Gurlow and Naz. Like most kids her age, Lily likes going to the movies, texting friends on her mobile, and dancing to the latest music. And her favourite pastime is shopping for shoes. It gets hard when we are training for competitions, but I still love it. My goal is to make the Australian team next year so I can represent my country at the Indo-Pacific Championships in New Zealand in 2008. To make the Australian team to go to these championships, Lily will have to compete against girls who are much older than her. She is against the odds here to make the top four placing that she is after. Lily's doing really, really well at the moment. Um, she's very focused and um, I don't see she will have too much of a problem. She'll definitely meet the qualifying scores uh, and she's still in with a good chance to make the Australian team. So, With only four places though, it's anybody's guess at what can happen in the end. It is believed that Lily is the first Indigenous girl to win an Australian championship in trampolining. And if she makes the Australian side, that she again will be the first Indigenous kid to do so in this up and coming and unknown sport. When Lily first joined the Southside Club, there was very limited quality equipment. No foam pit, and there's always a constant battle for money to fix or purchase new equipment. The Tramp Club is crammed in right down the back of the gym and is shared with the gymnastics girls. Ideally, the club would like to have its own designated area to train in, but given the limited space, this is impossible, so they battle on regardless. Despite all the obstacles that this small gym throws at Lily and her team at the Southside Gymnastics Club, they continue to churn out champions. Over the years, the club has produced numerous Queensland state team representatives, one Australian national champion in Brooke Michael, one double mini Australian representative in Chloe Albert, and now Lily, who is the current under 11 double mini national Australian champion for 2007. These are my trophies. Um, this is my favourite one because it's my Australian champion one, where I came first out of my age group in the whole of Australia. With so much belief in Lily and her abilities, Gary, Lily's coach, has agreed to stay on as her coach until she reaches her goal of representing Australia at the World Trampolining Championships in Russia in 2009. It's then that Gary will retire from coaching for good. So I'm considering at this stage staying through to end of World Championships 2009 because the girls then become the most experienced ones in their age division. Lily shows no sign of not wanting to meet those goals. Anything could happen between now and the world, but I really want to make it. It's my dream.